countries have different academic systems and in this video we are going to show you how to find the number of moles using two ways now let us say you have here 18 gram of O2 how can you find the number of moles now in the professional way we will use an expression expression is that one mole is equal to the atomic weight now the atomic weight for oxygen for one oxygen is 16 gram as given in the periodic table now here we have two of of o so it means that we will multiply by two and we will get the atomic weight as 32 gram now that we have the expression we will just use dimensional analysis so we have 18 gram and we want one mole we want the mole so we will put it on top here so it have multiplied by one mole divided by 32 grams now you can see here that the gram and the gram will cancel out and you will divide the 18 with the 32 here you will have here an answer of 18 divided by 32 which will finally give us 0 0.56 approximately and this here will be the number of moles we got and that is how you can simply get the number of moles using the professional way now let's see how we can get the number of moles using the way we learned at school that we will have a triangle here and the number of moles will be the mass divided by the molar mass mass is given as 18 grams so we write here 18 grams and the molar mass of this compound here will be 32 because we have here one oxygen and another oxygen together so we will add the masses of these oxygens which is 16 plus 16 to give us the molar mass as 32 and the unit of molar mass is gram per mole so we will divide it here we will put this in the place of molar mass so we'll have 18 grams divided by 32 grams per mole now calculate this you will have the same answer as 0 0.56 moles but if you have the number of molecules and uh, you want to find the number of moles how can you do that first way we will use the professional way by using an expression whereby one mole is equal to 6.023 times 10 power 23 molecules we'll take 2.4 times 10 power 24 molecules which we have and then we'll multiply because you want the mole here so you'll put the mole on top and then you will divide by the molecules which is 6.023 times 10 power 23 molecules so the molecules and the molecules will cancel out and then you will divide 2.4 times 10 power 24 with uh, this one here and then you will get the number of moles as 4 moles now for the other way we will use a triangle we'll use this triangle here so the number of molecules will be this n which is the big n and uh, the number of moles will be this small n and this will be Avogadro's number let's do it we we'll have here the number of moles is equal to the number of particles or molecules which is 2.4 times 10 power 24 divided by Avogadro's number which is 6.023 times 10 power 23 divide this and you'll get four moles and that is how you can simply get the number of moles by using the two ways